I appreciate that this bill has many good consumer protection provisions, and today I'm offering an amendment that would add to them by allowing the Department of Transportation to better use airline consumer complaints as a way of keeping airlines accountable for how they treat their customers. In 2012, Congress required that all airlines serving flights with over 30 passengers display the DOT Consumer Protection Hotline website and mailing address on their websites so that consumers could easily file complaints. While it's important that passengers try to resolve issues with their airlines, they should know that they have a right to log a complaint directly with the Department of Transportation. The data collected from these calls and online complaints is important to the DOT so that they can spot trends such as lost baggage and flight delays and create more effective rules. However, it's very difficult to find this number. I searched for the hotline number myself on different airline websites and couldn't find it anywhere. I also had the youngest staffer in my office who is proficient in in scrolling around websites, I, she looked for the hotline number and she spent an entire hour looking for it on each of the major airline websites and also couldn't track it down easily. If I can't find it, I'm assuming that many other flyers can't find it either and the data demonstrate that, demonstrates that. For example, in November of 2015, 25.3 million passengers flew on U.S. airlines, but the DOT reported only 989 complaints. Now, while it's possible that nearly every American flying to visit their family for Thanksgiving and the holidays had an easy, stress-free flight, I think it's more likely that people can't find this information or don't even know that a consumer hotline exists in the first place. My amendment will simply require airlines to post the DOT Consumer Protection Hotline in a prominent place on their websites. Con consumers should know that we have their backs. We already have a system in place. Let's just enforce it. I yield back. Uh, I thank the gentlelady. Um, Common sense. I thank the gentlelady for offering this amendment. I appreciate your dedication to uh, the efforts to protect the traveling public, and I urge all members to support uh, the General Lady's Amendment. Right. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Yeah. I'm not going to file a complaint um, against you. And with that, uh, all, any opposition to it? All in favor say aye. Aye. All opposed, no. The ayes have it, except the Hahn Amendment. They're accepted. Uh,